look at this cute apron. My mom gave it to me like um, <clears throat> 10 years ago. It used to have a string of pearls attached. Isn't that fun? Um, and I just recently found it. But anyway, so I'm going to make some chicken pot pie. Let's go make it. Alright. I have corn and potatoes chopped up and some chopped celery which was frozen so that's why there's little ice crystals on this and some roasted garlic that was also frozen that i had i also have a can of corn and a can of green peas i wanted english peas but i forgot to get them at the store and then i have my rotisserie chicken frozen and this is what i'm going to use to make it deliciously saucy um and then butter flake crust rolls for the crust this is gonna make way more than I thought. It's a big pile. Alright, this is simmering away. Um, that looks like a hair, but it's not. It's celery. So I added some chicken broth so that it wouldn't burn on the bottom of the pan. And I opened up the crescent roll and just kind of laid it over this pan. I want it to brown a little bit on the bottom so it's not raw. added the chicken in and I took this out. I was going to try to t peel this off of the pan and then put the mixture in and then put this on top like a crust but I don't think I'm going to be able to get it out so it's just going to be like a pie crust on the bottom. That's what we're doing. I'm not going to lie to you. This isn't pretty. I prepared what I could. Um, I think that it might take extensive surgery to fix the damage that's been done from this accident, but I don't know if we have the equipment. Um, I, I patched her up. Um, I've done all I can do. I think our best hope is just to wait and um, see what might happen in the oven, you know, over time. I'm gonna warn you, again, it's not pretty. I'm gonna show you, and some of you may want to shield your eyes, but, um, here she is. I've done all I can do. <laughs> I put some tin foil to prevent uh, browning in the oven, so let's see if she made it out okay. Well, this is all that I could do for her. I'm so 